We are the sixth wonders of the the world. treadmill junkie when I'm at the gym. A good 15 minutes on the treadmill, then move on to weight training and back on the treadmill for another 15 minutes. What I'm going to do today instead is I'm going to use every other piece of cardio equipment that my gym offers. A cross trainer, bike, and a rowing machine. I'm do each of those for 10 minutes and do weights in between again to get myself that same kind of um, cross train feel where I'm, I'm doing weights and cardio at the same time, keeping my heart rate up. I just want to feel like at the end of this, that those three machines have given me a different kind of, of workout today than the treadmill normally does give me. And challenge myself to use those machines more often because they, they will work different parts of my body. So let's see how I do. week for me. I've had so many out of the ordinary things happen. I had some surgery so that kind of put me out for a few days. Um, I'm fine now. But then I lost my phone, my iPhone. Annoying. I left it on the bus of all the things that you could do. Uh, so and then when I went to claim on my insurance Turns out I had been sold um, a scam, basically, that I will be getting a new iPhone, at least not free of charge. <laughs> but then, the scale was finally my friend this week. I've been wavering between 208, 203, 204 since about January, since the end of January, and, you know, it, it hasn't seemed to have mattered what my routine was, what my diet was. The scale was not budging. My clothes were fitting looser. I was feeling wonderful. But the scale was not going to show it. And then the other morning I woke up 
and it was like I had dropped five pounds overnight and it said 199 and that was thrilling for me you know it's just because I let myself get back over 200 after having lost 60 pounds that was um that was a big hurdle for me so seeing that 199 and it was 198 yesterday has kind of kept my mood up all week even through the crap so thanks for watching